Green Ken Doherty world champion 22 years ago against 22 year old Lucas Kleckers from Germany Ken beat Adam Stefan off of Poland in the first round and Kleckers beat Jeremy O'Neill with a whitewash We've seen a few of the veteran contingent make it through haven't we of course Jimmy White and Alan McManus amongst them. Dominic Dale as well. Let's see how Ken gets on here against Germany's number one player from Essen. Ken's uh, been in a couple of last 16s in the shootout. Nothing special by his standards, I guess. Yeah, the interesting. Well, has he got it off? He's got it off. What a bad start. And it was an in-off that seemed unlikely. I was going to say, actually, and it is true that Kleckers is, is one of the slowest players on the tour, which I didn't really envisage when he first came onto the tour. He's the third slowest behind Rod Lawler and Lee Walker. At the stop, Rod Lawler doing well in shootouts, Nuka, but I would say that he can play quicker. I don't know why, how he's got so slow. So I think he can... You know, he's not, he's not that he's a, sort of a, a plodder or anything. Eight. Well, first match of the day, Ricky Walden with his first shot went in off. Nine. And Luca Russell made a century from it. That was that. Over. Can't afford to be slow in this. Whatever his average shot time is, he's got to be quick. Yeah, I just think sometimes someone, a youngster like Lucas Clegg, almost could do with something 16. like this to just remind him that you can play quicker. The longer you look at shots, the more things you can see that can go wrong on them. So he's making his mind up to play fluency. I do like his game. He's not, he's not set the world alight, but he definitely is good. I just feel he's got himself bogged down in matches. That's not healthy. This could be a change he needs. 24. Going at 30 seconds plus per shot over the course of the season. Well, he's made something out of it. He's not. He's not done. A, not done what happened earlier on with Brussel and Walden, as you were saying. But he does. Uh, you know, he's made inroads there. He's got himself a few in front. He's played a good shot there, so he's kept the pressure on, hasn't he? on here and get something happening now here made sure he hit that hard enough here because he bounced out of bolt he's so sure of it now this goes in it could be in for a second time very talented play I think Germany crying out for One. Simon Lichtenberg is also on the tour. 
Click, as, as you say, is their number one performer. And very much in the learning curve. But Six. Things go his way. He could make the required progress. Is staying on the tour, isn't it? That's the problem. Look well, of course, Doherty dropped off the tour, but was given a discretionary wild card along with Jimmy. Oh, that's a One. good shot, but I tell you, now that red, has it covered the blue? Which means he might have to have a, a dart at the green here. Get through the blue? Just can. Great shot. That was clean. Well, that's one from the Ken Doherty top tour, isn't it? So he's in. The Dubliner was open the red's previous shot, so this is a good chance. Seven. He'd love to get on that. He'd love to get on that red by the by the black spot, you know. I mean, I don't suppose it's. I mean, he's thinking about right this second, but if there was an opportunity to roll that through on the black, it would be it'd be away. However, he can win the frame on what's in the middle of the table. So he's over screwed there. side on, on these cloths can do make you do funny things i think he's playing it with check to hold he's made a terrible hash of it seven oh, could he's smiling but it's a bit Eight. of a grimace as well he's got to hope that his young opponent Throws in a quick one and maybe snatches at one. This could be the one. There's pressure on him to finish this off. Yeah, just slightly stretching on this. He didn't come back far enough. Very nice. Well, Ken can't really say he didn't have a chance because he, he absolutely did. And when he missed, it was a surprise to us all, actually, that the shot he missed after the ones he'd been getting. should not be thinking about playing these shots quicker than he has to. What Jimmy White did earlier on, he should be listening for the bleeps. 21. Playing quickly. You don't need the time that's allowed. You don't need to make this a long frame to uh, use your time up. Anyway, the fact remains this. 27. He's almost on the brink anyway. This red is the one. This is right ball. Snooker's required. Very well done, Lucas Kleckers. 28. Taking him a couple of visits. Can the chance in between all that? So on this occasion, experience wasn't the key. I think he's a better player when he plays cricket, Dave. That might be something for him to think about way beyond when the shootout finishes and for the rest of the season. I think he's got a bit of fluency. But he has got bogged 36. down. You know, the average shot times for the season tells you he's right down the bottom amongst all the real slow coaches. Lucas Kleckers. Round of applause from his opponent is Craig Teckers from Kleckers. He's into the third round of the shootout. And we have one more match to come. It features another former champion. Barry Hawkins against Zhang Anders. Stay with us. One more match tonight, live from Watford after the break. 